solid offense, solid defense, a good team basketball, and they did it in exemplary fashion last night. Well, Houston came out. They had been beaten by Denver, losing 20 points on their home opener. And they tried to bogard the Warriors. They came out very physically with a lot of intensity. They were not dependent on their three-point shooting, Bob. Raymond rolling this time. A nice hook pass from Steph Curry. Well, Curry who dropped. Davis switched out on Curry. And Steph shot that from Mississippi. That was a 30-footer. Steph Curry moving without the ball. Draymond. Tony Douglas, a former Warrior. As I said, he played 12 games with them last year. He's in there for defense against Curry. And that means that Curry, he's hitting threes that defy description right now. About help defense, but sometimes you do leave someone a lane to get a rebound. Steph Curry, beautiful teardrop. Thompson in transition. Clay's got 14, Steph's got a dozen. Draymond, that trail three off the Curry creation. Steph zigzagging. And getting to the line. Steph Curry getting banged around, and Harrison Barnes able to put it down and draw the foul. How what pretty a play. was that? What a play by Curry. People hanging all over me, weaves in and out. Oh, man. Take a look at this. Gets all tangled up. Three defenders. Comes up with control of the basketball. Steph a deep three. Hit another one. Curry. And to the line. And the Warriors start to assert themselves here. Curry three. Rimming in. You were so worried about those ones that rimmed out last night. The human torch. Steph setting up Clay Thompson. Never get easier than that. I play within myself. He says every best player has to learn to become more efficient. Well, how about efficient on that? Draymond with a three. They just play They play much better when it's a little loose. Curry down the lane to lay it up and in. Well, he schooled him. Yeah. Steph Curry, another three. I'm telling you, you could not beat Curry around the corner to the rim again. And Livingston to the steal. The push ahead to Steph has got to beat Babbitt. Goes around the back to lay it in. Oh what a play! All of a sudden, the Pelicans crowd here, partisan as they are, they're appreciating the play of Stephen Curry, the MVP. 22 in the third quarter. What's he and, got? And the lay it again. Oh. 24. Heat check. And a four-point play opportunity. Oh. Hits the three, draws the foul. They get a guy in foul trouble. And Steph reheats. Yes, he can. Game kind of hanging there right now. The Warriors put the Pelicans away. That three will go a long way. Draymond. And the Pelicans still alive until Curry steals it. And Barnes has the dunk. That is a big play. That's Steph drawing all that attention. How about 47 for Steph Curry? Curry for three and 51. <laughs> he makes believers out of it, but they still don't get up any closer. Rick Barry and Will Chamberlain, the only other Warriors with three or more 50-point games. Steph Curry joins them tonight. And he's going to go to the line. Curry with a steal. Push ahead for Draymond to lay it up and in. If they do, we know who it is. Well, the two-game road trip is over. Warriors win it 134-120. to 120. Curry spectacular. They beat New Orleans, they beat Houston, they beat New Orleans to begin the defense of the NBA title. Steph, 28 points in the third quarter. As, it, as you were starting to heat up, did you let the game, did you let the shots come to you or were you looking for your shots? Man, when you get a big quarter like that, it's a little bit of both. I got some team, uh, some screens off pick and roll and off the ball that got me some free looks. And then out of that, you start to get creative and try to be more aggressive, uh, and test out the hot hand. So 
Well, it's a little bit of both and just have a confidence. So far this season, it looks like you're getting very comfortable taking deep, 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 deep threes. Are you working on that? I mean, what is your range? Is there anywhere that you hesitate? I mean, with that reason, but uh, I hope that I keep making them. Uh, you know, it gives me that much more confidence if, if uh, you miss a couple in a row. I want to get a little bit closer, but keep shooting. But I mean, I, as long as I'm making them, I'll keep taking them within the within rhythm. You know, you mentioned to me yesterday part of your improving off of an MVP season is continuing to trust your teammates. How does trusting your teammates help you perform? I mean, it just allows us to be more of a powerful offense. Uh, when I get going and then, you know, being able to draw a defender or double teams or what have you, move the ball and everybody gets touches and everybody is able to get some shots and some good looks. We're a tough team. We have so much talent out there. So I want to try to come out and be consistent and get everybody involved and um, you know, also look for my shot and, and, uh, and make it happen. You had 40 against the Pelicans opening night, 50, over 50 here. Is it something that the Pelicans are giving you or is this going to happen to anyone in the league? <laughs> Uh, I mean, I come out every game with the same mentality, trying to just uh, leave an imprint on the game. So, um, you know, hot start to the season. I want to try to keep it going. And we're 3-0 in the process, so that's all that matters. All right, thanks, Steph. Congrats. Congrats.